After 29 years of living as a struggling laborer, he learned today that his grandfather was an invisible billionaire, but to inherit his grandfather's $100 million, he must get married before his 30th birthday and have a child within 5 years, if he doesn't. The money goes to charity. Grandpa's dying to get married. Jack froze in his tracks. Tomorrow was his 30th birthday, and he just pissed off his girlfriend two and a half days earlier. So that was the end of it. But in order to $100 million Jack were wearing a ring to Anna's door to say a bunch of earthy words of love results in the door open he realized that inside is Anna's best friend. Turns out Anna was going overseas for two and a half weeks and had just left half an hour before he came to the door. When Jack heard that, he was anxious. If he waited for Anna to come back, the food would be cold. He drove all the way to catch Anna before she got on the plane. Looking at Jack kneeling down without saying a word, Anna was touched and asked him if he was really willing to marry her. Unexpectedly this sentence but Jack asked the question is baffled. His look of longing for a free and easy life as a sea king immediately made Anna realize that he was not ready at all, which made Anna angry again. Jack didn't expect his proposal to fail again, since the current one didn't work. He had to go to his ex. He immediately took the roses and went to his ex-girlfriend who was a stock trader to ask her to marry him. But he didn't realize that she was already married. Then Jack found his ex-girlfriend who was a shop assistant and she was interested in Jack and quickly agreed to marry him. But then Jack saw Anna's figure in the window. He was anxious to leave the girl directly chased out, but only to realize that he recognized the wrong person. Now the girl he was so sure of is gone. Let's get another girl who sings opera. Turns out she's a sea king like Jack and can't even remember Jack's name. The next policeman's ex-girlfriend's formidable strength made him give up on the spot. The chef's ex-girlfriend spoke like a lullaby and he was out of it before he could react. The last ex-girlfriend agreed to Jack's request for $100 million. But when she heard that she wanted to have a baby, she just ran away without saying a word. His best friend, Fatty, and the pastor have been running with Jack all day. But none of them have succeeded. Jack was going to give up on the deadline tomorrow. But then Fatty came up with the idea that he could get Jack married tomorrow. When Jack woke up the next day, he found himself surrounded by brides in wedding dresses. What's going on here? 